these three properties are most important properties the first one is the position so in css we have a property called position that specifies the position of that element where the element should be appear in the web page the position having four five important values that are position static absolute fixed and a relative and sticky so here the position it specifies a visual position of the element in the web page the default the static is a default position so what is a static so displays the element in normal position where the content is a uh, defaultly it could be provides what is mean by absolute displays the element based on x and y coordinate elements can be scrolled so how we can be give that one i can show you the left side left to some space so suppose this is a space suppose border so here you can give some space and the top value and that which will be takes the defaultly it would be takes that only the next one a fixed one display the element based on x and y values but coordinates elements doesn't scroll so when you are giving some fixed position elements then automatically the elements even you scroll that even you scroll that that never be moved one area to another area it will be fixed next one relative so display the element based on the x and y coordinates but the counted based on the parent element based on the parent element values it would be the takes the next one sticky when scroll the page up and down always the element stick to their position even scroll the page when you observe this one i'll show the detailly right so here this is your page and this is your output here you observe uh, actually we are taking only three well three tags but i want to take more tags p tag lorem lorem and uh, some tags i want to take for multiple times i want to take multiple times copy so number of times i want to take here yes right multiple times so when i am using this one when i am using position so what is a position position tag a b tag only so it one i am taking a fixed one fixed then you observe when i am scrolling this not a uh, fixed uh, i don't want to use this i tag i don't want to use this i tag here right now so it is a fixed one automatically the the neighbor tags the coordinate will be occupies when i am using sticky sticky then you observe sticky what happens it always so here fixed i am taking here fixed then you observe where while scrolling while scrolling the b tag is always there always there right so when you observe it will be takes so here i am using sticky then what happen sticky refresh when i am refreshing this sticky just observe when scroll the page up and down always the element stick to their position even we scroll it never be disturbs right but when i am using this uh, relative then what happens so not relatives absolute absolute what happens the element based on x and y coordinates it can be scrolled actually but the neighbor tag can be disturbs right 
so that happens this uh, position tag but when we are using this uh, one more tag is there display property display suppose when you decide whether the element should be appear in the web page or not so by using that you can decide so here i want to use this one so here sticky i'm using sticky no issue but there is a p tag actually this is a lorem is a p tag but i don't want to display that i don't want to display that so here what happens just to observe display none i am using here none what happens so not a b tag i want to change this one no, sorry sorry b tag so i want to apply for this uh, paragraph tag now so paragraph tag only i want to update so what happens so the p tag will be automatically p tag will be automatically hide right hidden but even though the space is also not leaves so commonly no one can be observed the tag is removed tag is a hidden right so no one will be observed so this display property having another two values the block and inline and inline to block the element displayed in the same line width and height property will have effect inline so when we change the block level element to inline element so then we can use this one the change the display inline so just to observe actually this paragraph i don't want to use this this paragraph this a uh, block level element actually so otherwise b tag is a inline element so i want to change this one display display so it could be inline i don't display this is not a suitable suppose i want to take here h1 tag h1 tag actually h1 tag is a block level element so i want to display inline inline then what happens h1 comma what tags we are using h1 div inline elements then automatically you observe completely block level element is converting to inline element that can be done by this display tag with help of display tag the block level element to convert we are converting to inline element and inline element converting to block level element so none in a, none in the sense all elements could be hidden hidden right that is a benefit of this display and there is a one more that would be visibility so what is a visibility so here also we can hide the tag here also we can hide the tag but the difference is that when you are disable this one display none it completely hide right so but i want to change this when you observe this is a display hide but when i am using visibility visibility i want to use visibility hidden then what happens so here the space is leaves actually space is leaves again you observe i want to use the same one h1 tag so first i want to use display none so automatically this block level elements will be gone h1 tags will be gone but i want to use the same display in the place of display tag i am using visibility visibility then what happens hidden you observe the change it leaves a space the display can never leave the blank blank space that hidden space but visibility can be leave the space the interviewer can ask the what is the difference between and display and visibility the first you can say the display can convert block level element to inline element and inline to block level element that is the first difference and visibility can never do the second one is the when you are using display none the content will be hidden but the hidden space is not visible 
it not leave the space on the browser when you are using visibility property with a hidden value then it hide the content but it never hide the space the space empty space is visible so that is the difference between the both a display and visible so in this lecture we covered the pos position and uh, display and visibility these three properties are most important properties and uh, in a real time we use more for responsiveness thank you so much have a nice day bye bye